Still waiting for the company commander, Sarge. Hold it. King 6 is a white rug. Mission accomplished. Destroyed half track with Senator X ray yoke. Waiting rendezvous with King 2. Over. Roger, out. I thought Tim and Barker would be back by now with Lieutenant. So did I. We'll give him a couple more minutes. The squad must have rendezvoused with McGowan by now. We can pick up the others. Let's head back. a chance. Go surrounded. Throw those guns forward. Welcome, Lieutenant. You're my third catch of the day. You may put your hands down, Lieutenant. My name is Captain Reichardt. Perhaps you've heard of me. Yeah, I've heard of you. And your methods. You must understand, Lieutenant. Reichardt's raiders are interested only in American officers. Enlisted men can never give us reliable information. You do not wish a cigarette? May I have your map, please? I hope to collect more American officers before this day is over. Lieutenant, if you please. My men will take you to join your fellow officers. You will be very comfortable there until this evening. Then I will join you for the ride back to our line. Auf Wiedersehen.
Tim calling. I can hardly hear him. I think he's hurt. King two, this white rock over. King two, this white rock over. Proud roadblock. Near Hill 300. Rikers, Raiders, captured Hanley. This raid has got the lieutenant. Let's go. this road. How is he, Doc? Not too good. Tim. Yeah, Johnny? You're gonna be okay. You know that, don't you? Sure. <laughs> Are you positive it was Captain Reichardt? Told Lieutenant Hanley that's who he was. He speaks English for the, like a limey. It was a roadblock that stopped us. They gunned down Barker and me from the woods. We never had a chance. Rykut's got more of our officers stashed away somewhere. He sent Lieutenant Hanley off in a Jerry Jeep. Then he and his men left in a troop carrier to get more prisoners. Just officers. He's an officer I'd like to get my hands on. You know where they were taking Lieutenant Hanley? I couldn't be too far away. Rackett said he'd be back before night to pick him up. Which way to go, Tim? He went.
We couldn't have done him much good even if we'd gotten him to a hospital. How about it? Tim said that way. Give Doc a hand. Now let's clear all this stuff away. King two, this is white rug. King two, this is white rug. Over. I can't make contact, Sarge. It's probably his hills we'll call in later. SS men probably belong to Reichardt. Well, what are we waiting for? Just take it easy. Savoya, take McGowan's men and the weapons carry go around the back of the building. Don't open up until I do. You got it? Yeah. McGowan, you're on me. <laughs>
Look out, radio. Okay. White one, this is White Rook, over. White Pawn, this is White Rook, over. This is White Pawn, over. Bob, tell them to surrender. Tell them they can't get out. Let them surrender the way they let Tim and Barker surrender. Hold one. The Germans can't tell us where Lieutenant Hanley is. Bob, tell them. Get off! It has keine Chance, herauszukommen. Get off! Ihr habt keine Chance, herauszukommen. Should we fire, Sarge? Well, how long are you going to give them before you let them get out? Bob, you tell them if they don't come out, we're going to open up again. When you hear us, you open up. Hold it, Bob. Hold your fire. There's Toad. Todd Drennan. He's dead in the building. We go and check it out. Cage. Tell them to keep their hands up. They're hand to everything cop. Spread them out along the fence. Strip them down and search them. Forget it. My job is to find Lieutenant Hanley. Put those weapons in the carrier. Ask him where our offices are being held. Wo werden die amerikanischen Offiziere gefangen gehalten? Ich weiß nicht. Unser Hauptmann war der Einzige, der den Platz wusste. He doesn't know. Only their officer knew the place. Ask him. Wo sind die amerikanischen Offiziere? Ich weiß nicht. Unser Hauptmann war der Einzige, der den Platz wusste. He doesn't know. Only the officer knew the place. Wo werden die amerikanischen Offiziere gefangen gehalten? Ich weiß nicht. Unser Hauptmann war der Einzige, der den Platz wusste. He doesn't know. Only the officer knew the place. Those are his exact words? Yeah. All three of them give you exactly the same answer, right? Same song, same chorus, all three. All right, let's ask the wounded man. Tell me 
won't take him prisoner. We'll exchange him for our officers if he tells us where they are. Der Feldweber sagt, wir tauschen ihn aus, wenn ihr uns sagt, wo die amerikanischen Offiziere gefangen gehalten sind. Unser Hauptmann war der Einzige, der den Platz wusste. Now I'll tell you exactly the same answer as the other ones outside, right? That's right. Did you find out anything? Yeah. Somebody rehearsed them real good. Everyone will give exactly the same answer. They don't know where Lieutenant Hanley is, only their officer knew. He's dead. Doc. Doc, come here, will you? That looked like a bullet wound you. No. No, he caught a chunk of steel. Could it be like a chunk of shrapnel from a landmine? Yeah, or probably got it when the vehicle blew up. And this can't be kept from right card. This man must have been dying when they brought him in here. Oh, well, didn't we see an officer give orders and running things out there? Not this guy, not with a wound like that. It only means one thing. There's a crowd of listed man up there. It's really Captain Reichardt. <laughs> It's alive. Hiding behind that guy's uniform? I don't see why I'd want to hide his rank, though. If I was going to a POW camp, I'd sure want him to know I was an officer. Not if you were right, Hart. Maybe you're right. But his reputation is sure to give him a rough time. I'll have to wait their turn. I get him first. Parker and Tim were in my squad. They're my men. I'll find out who he is. I'll take one of those crowds and I'll just beat it out of him. All right, take it easy. None of those crowds out there are going to put their finger on right, Hart. So what are you going to do? Are you going to sit around here and wait until they take Hanley back behind enemy lines? No, I'm not going to wait. I'm going to find out who Reichardt is. How? I don't know yet. The only thing we have to go on is that Reichardt speaks English. Over here, at attention. And I'm a liar. I'm threatened. Do you stand it? Bomb. Name, rank, and serial number. Name, rank, and erkennungsnummer. Manfred Schulz, Soldat. Erkennungsnummer 18967745. Name, Rank und Erkennungsnummer. Helen Kraus, Soldat, Nummer 1745-9973. Straighten up. All right, I can now talk fast and in English. I speak English, too. Captain Reichardt handpicked his men. We're all specially trained as infiltrators and saboteurs. Naturally, we speak English. We didn't try to hide it. We said nothing because you didn't ask us. That ain't funny, Kraut. All right, get back. I'll get the truth. I said it. get back. I say it's a sergeant. He jumped in awful fast to take the other guy off the hook. Well, he's a sergeant. Maybe he's just taking care of his men. Yeah. Like you, Saunders. Well, look, what about the corporal there? He spoke good English. He kept right up with the sergeant, didn't he? Yeah, man, they're all trying to protect the captain while the real right heart keeps his mouth shut. Look, let's stop the playing around. This is the only thing that'll work. We're running against the clock, Sarge. If your lieutenant gets out of the area, we won't be able to help him. Tom. If the captain's better educated, can you be able to tell by his speech? I'm not sure. I can give it a try. All right. Sarge. That wounded man's conscious again, but I don't know for how long. I'll talk to him. 
What good's that gonna do? You're just wasting time, Saunders. I tell you, Saunders don't know what he's doing. Right off, Mac. Saunders knows what he's doing. Feeling better? It's all right, I know all records ready to speak English. Your corporal told us. Doc, tell me that the medicine he gave you helped. Thank you. I feel better. It's nothing to be afraid of. I'm not afraid of him. He's a good man. I want to know where our offices are being held. If you tell me, I'll make sure that we send you back. He's out again. Doc, he trusts you. Next time he comes to me, he can get in the talk. You better find another way, Sarge. I don't think he's going to do much talking, even if he wants to. Well, find anything? They weren't kidding when they said they were handpicked. They all talk like university students. I had to make out with your prize pupil inside. I suppose he broke down and told you everything, hmm? Passed out again. Look, Saunders, what's all this go by the book stuff? You want to find Hanley or don't you? You know what they'd do if they were holding the guns? They'd blow our brains out. All right. I'll leave it up to you guys. Sure, Saunders wears the stripes, but for my dough, they just decorate his sleeves. I'll tell you how I'd run the show. Just take a look at him. SS Superman, huh? Nothing can scare him, huh? Well, I know how to scare him. I'd do it their way. I'd start shooting him up one at a time. I'd make the others watch. They'll talk. Believe me, they'll talk. about any help from him. He's dead. All right, McGowan. Like you said, we'll try it that way. When I put on this uniform, I was taught to go by a certain book of rules. You're forcing me to throw away that book. Yeah, the corporal's right. That's the only kind of language you understand. Now, I don't care anymore which one of you is Captain Reichart. All I want to know is one thing. Where our offices are being held. Where are our offices being held? I don't know. You don't know, huh? All right. I'm going to take you inside one by one. I'm going to ask you the same question. And I'm going to give you 30 seconds. And if you give me the same answer, you're going to get a bullet in your head. Inside. Come on, inside. Give 
Sergeant, you can't. Doc, you keep your mouth shut. If you do this thing, Sergeant, it will be in direct violation of the Geneva Convention. Geneva Convention to you is just a scrap of paper. I repeat, you are in violation of the Geneva Convention. You didn't give our men a chance to surrender. Well, I'm going to give you a chance. I'll give you all a chance. 30 seconds. 30 seconds! Inside! Cage. Sarge. Inside, that's an order. McGon! They tried, then you know what to do. seconds to tell me what I want to know. Twenty seconds. Fifteen seconds. Card. Step forward. You are very clever, Sergeant. Even the best trained men will turn to their leader under stress. Now that you know who I am, what can you do about it? I know what to do about it. So do I. Let's talk business. Business? Psychology tricks won't work on me, Sergeant. No, no tricks. I want to make a deal. You tell me we're holding the American officers and I'll get permission to exchange you for them. You underestimate my value, Sergeant. Your superiors would never consent to such a trade. It's worth a try. I'll call in. I assume my man inside is still alive and unharmed? That's right. Kirby, Cage, bring him out. Nice. Real. You mean it was all a gag? You couldn't go through it, huh? And it goes soft. No guts. I just wanted that cops to make a chop on you again. Yeah. Interesting contrast between your sergeant and your corporal. Yeah. That's where your luck comes in, Captain. Your superior said no? Can't reach headquarters because of the hills. We'll drive to higher ground. Kirby, you're on me. You sure know how to operate. 
I don't know what you mean. I sure you do. You just finagled your own release. The offer of prisoner exchange was made by your sergeant. Yeah, that's right, it was. Because you had the arm on him, you had him over a barrel. Take it easy, Mac. The Sarge had everything under control. Don't worry, Sawyer. Don't worry. Tell me something, Captain. What happens if our brass refuses some of his offer? What happens if they won't exchange you for Hanley? I prefer to talk to your sergeant about that. Oh. Well, I prefer you talk to me. Now, get in that house. Okay, now, you know what Sarge said. I don't care what Saunders said. Saunders ain't here, and I'm the only two-striper in the bunch. That puts me in charge. Yeah, but you've got no right. I got every right. If I want to question a prisoner, I got every right to do it, and I don't need any advice from any of you. Now move! I'm not going to let you sit him in cold blood! All right, Doc, keep it. I don't need it anyway. Like I told you, I'm just going to question him, and he's going to tell me where Hanley is. Now, inside! My God! They're asking for a court-martial. It'll be a pleasure. We go in there before he kills Rackard. Doc, wait. Killed you, let Reichardt get away. Almost. He sure knows his judo. You all right? Yeah. You feel okay, Jim? Yeah, he's mine in the store. Let's go. He's out in the open. Wonder why he left the trees. He is onto us. He knows we let him go. Well, what are we gonna do? Play it his way, right out in the open. Want to let him see us? That's right.
Well, hard now, Sarge. He took the fork to the left here. Yeah, I saw him. We're going to go straight ahead. Kirby, stay close enough to him that he knows he's being followed. After a while, let him lose you and head right back to the farmhouse. Well, what for? Well, he knows we're on his tail. He's heading east. So I figure he's got Hanley stashed somewhere to the west. You got it? I sure hope you're right, Sarge. Yeah, so do I. Let's go. Where do we go? Yeah, well, he has to be stashed alone here somewhere. We'll just have to keep looking. What if it gets dark before he comes? Then we'll take her along the side of the road and wait for Rockhart to come along and show us the way. It took you so long. I don't wait for Reichardt to show us the way. You got him outside? He'll be along any minute. You pretty sure then? Yeah, we are, Lieutenant. Reichardt's like got his reputation to think of. Take your line this time. Drop it. I underestimated you, Sergeant. It was stupid of me. Tie him up. Ready to roll, Lieutenant. All right, let's go. 